Hey guys. A quick one. We're in the middle of running the rest of our wires for our bedroom in this foyer space. So we're rough wiring now. And there's a bunch of stuff going on. We had set this up temporarily, the dryer and washer. Of course, we still have to put tile on the floor and drywall on the walls, but rather than have it in the area that it was, which was always temporary, we put it on where it's gonna be permanently. And made a little quick shelf and put our camera surveillance stuff up there. Eventually, we're gonna put the uh, media stuff for the television and surround sound over here. But um, you can see we're running our wires. switch wires and feed wires and outlet wires, receptacle. Yeah, we have a thermostat wire out here from the boiler room. Um, so that's about it. Just figuring out where we want to put our recess lights. And we already knew what we wanted for switching. This particular box has a couple of uh, switches to control some outside lighting on the decks out there. Um, so that's about it. Just running a few wires, and then once we're done with our wiring, we can get in here and start insulating. And then after we're done insulating, we could uh, jump on a baseboard heat if we need to get near the wall with some stuff we can and then after that we can drywall compound and stuff and then we can we'll be moving along pretty good but right now we're just running a few of our rough wiring for lights and uh, power the outlets and we're gonna run some speaker wires for the surround sound and that's pretty much it then we can insulate anyways you guys that's about it. We're just doing some wiring. And we like to label everything as we do it. Things like that. All right, you guys. That's it. Just sharing how we're making out. We're uh, running our wires. We'll post another video as we, uh, maybe after we insulate. I don't know, just basic stuff. If anyone's following along, though, well, you want to see what we're up to, and that's what we're doing. We're on our wiring, so. Then we use 20, 12 2 for our outlets, because the outlets are on 20 amp arc faults, and then the, and then our lighting circuits are 14 gauge. 14 2. So everything's um, LED, low voltage. So they don't really draw hardly anything, so 15 amp breakers. All right, guys, that's it for now. Just um, sharing what we're up to. We'll post more as we make more progress. All right, guys, take it easy. Till the next one.